you. Turn to Shiro Jutsu Island, where we have Jacob put into a corner. And we're going to be seeing what he's going to try to say. A girl like it. A girl right. What? Jacob know who the killer is? What the? What's he? He's dropping on us to learn information that could unmask the killer. Blade, blade, uh, because I, I. Jacob and the other two appear to be negotiating, but I still can't hear what they're saying. Vince and Abby don't appear to be very open to negotiation. I have a feeling something very bad is about to happen. Huh? <laughs> hey, what's going on here? Well, you'll see what's going on. Looks like everyone in the guest room building heard the, commo heard the commotion and has come here. Rahil, Kara, Jessel, and Alex are all here. Are all here. Get away from the door, Fane. Has a gun. He may shoot you. Stay out of the line of sight. <laughs> all, right. all right. But what the hell is going on? He's got to get. Yeah. He got his gun pointed at Jacob. What's going on? Well, I think Jacob's trying to cut a deal with them. Jacob, you come over here. <laughs> We're trying to help you, man. We, we want answers. Prison time to save for the game shot. <laughs> help. <laughs> I think Jacob's oh yeah, trying to cut a deal. That just get though. Looks like the negotiations have fallen apart. <laughs> and that makes it fun. But what that kind of shot? What happened? Tell me. Um, he's laying down and taking a really long nap. It's not very not a very pleasant sight. Don't look alright. Hey babe, you okay? That was a headshot from the hip. Vince appears to be an expert marksman. This is a warning to the killer. This is a warning to the killer. If you have 30 minutes, don't tell me code like that. I will kill everyone without mercy. Vince. That's it. What code do you want? Detective, outside outsiders shouldn't talk much, or their lives will cut will be cut short here. What? Oh, well, that doesn't exactly look like hip. That looks like a lower rib. I see Vincent. I see Vincent's muzzle move in my direction and quickly take cover. Suddenly, the iron doors on both sides close. As the guest rooms and the main building are separated again. We have 30 minutes. Not a lot of time. There's no point in asking the killer for help now. I'll have to reveal the identity. Let's go back to my room. We can discuss what to do next there. How can you say stay calm after that? You said we have 30 minutes. What what is the code anyway? What do they want? Just, just calm down. Let me think. We have half an hour. 
one of us is the killer, and I'm over here as a detective, as I have Nicket Netico over here as a freaking high school student. Let's go to my room and plan our next move. There. Now don't tell me you're just gonna shoot yourself in the head. Bitch! I'm not drunk enough to do that yet. Besides, if I had to shoot someone, I'd shoot the person who got us into this mess in the first place. Well, we got everyone but Jacob. Died twice so far. God damn it. If I pick a third option, he dies again. God damn it. He's really desperate. He's really enjoying being killed. Like, God damn. What the fuck is wrong with this motherfucker? You slowly fucking loser. Like, come on. the big reveal. To sell this once and for all. I sure already know who the killer is. Fuck. I should have saved. Okay. I'll check. Okay, it looks like they're not gonna let me save. God damn it, game. I will have to go through all this again! <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go with, um, Okay, let me narrow this down. We have to take out Ms. Vincent and Abigail. So, they're all the, the entire thing. I don't think it's Aurora. Since we've asked several people and they we pretty much know nothing about them. I don't think it's me. I don't think it's Ikeda or Neneko. Rahil kind of ratted herself out. So, Valerie. Oh, also, Jacob and Thomas are dead. So, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, five six, seven. Let's see. That, we, that, that kind of cuts down the options we've gotten to. Actually, that rips out like eight options. Isn't really helpful when eight of our fucking options are gone. <laughs> I'm not even joking. Eight of our options are gone. We lost. So that means we have Atari, Gessel, and Alex. To an extent, I kind of want to choose Gessel. Uh, and or Alex. That's the way I see it. Atari, Katara, unless she's like a really good actor, I don't think it's her. That's what I think. But it is possible, and they have tried to kill one. They almost killed her once before. So, yeah. Well, they have killed her once before, considering this series. At least, as far as I know, Ika, Neneko. Oh, Neneko has died several times. <laughs> as far as I know. Kari has died once. Gissel has died once. And I think Alex also died once. Neneko got traumatized in that one. <laughs> so, uh. To an extent, I kind of want to pick Rahel. But the other option could easily be one of these three. And I'm going to do multiple choice here to be on the safe side. I'm going to start with Gessel. And she's not the killer because I know that Rahel ratted herself out. You can immediately. Yeah, because Rahel ratted herself out as an agent. It could be a lie. Keep that in mind. It could be a lie. So, Rahel is plan B. 
and then I'll go straight to Akari, and if that doesn't work, it's Alex. So that's what I'm going with. That's right. The only one who could be the killer is... Yes! <laughs> For hell, I need you to cooperate with me, alright? Uh, yes, of course. How can I help? It's only for a teeny tiny thing. Huh? Hey, is this some kind of joke? Why are you trying me? Tying me up? Hey, my head hurts. Hey, why are we tying up Rahel? Rahel, you're the killer, aren't you? What? <laughs> we're blaming Rahel regardless? <laughs> I thought we were gonna go with, like, uh, with anyone else. What? <laughs> I thought Rahel was gonna freaking survive this entire run. <laughs> I was trying to go through with as many people trying to survive as possible. Uh, no way! <laughs> So, so she's the killer. That's right. Is this a lose lose situation? Like it didn't matter what I chose. <laughs> like goddamn, I knew she was my second guess. So I don't think I really remember seeing Re uh, no, no, uh, guess will really react to anything. Oh, that that's what I was going on. So I didn't. I don't remember seeing guess will react. I knew Rahel can kill a good amount of people, but that was it. <laughs> That's right. First of all, Rahel and Alex were the only two people who had the opportunity to set a trap on the bridge that could kill Thomas. So, this allows me to narrow down the list of suspects. Oh yeah, I... I didn't even put that into account. <laughs> uh, down to two people. I I actually did not put that into a, an account. Then there's the murder of Sir Raymond. I always wondered why exactly Sir Raymond was caught off guard. But in the end, it didn't matter. The killer only needed to unlock the door and sneak into the room where the meeting was about to be held was about to be held. Did you see the unlocked door? Did you see the unlocked door? But how did she do that? Actually, she she's really undercover against the agent. It's an undercover agent who is sneaking into this island. She's Highly trained. Not only can she pick locks, but her assassina assassination skills are also first class. Huh. How did she kill Thomas? Whoa, that's a good question. I will leave you to question that later. Well, we interrogate. And she should already know that part. <laughs> we don't need to. We don't need to anymore. We can just ask the killer herself. That's right. Come on, Hill. Give up already. Ikada. What are you thinking? Do you really think I'm the killer? You idiot. Someone else is the killer. What? Why? What is she? She just became a totally different person. Do you mean she's been acting this whole time? Maybe. Don't tell me that we're just gonna sacrifice Rahel. 
Look at how it's that. That's an average detective. Next now when I think that I'm actually surprised an average your regular detective caught a freaking cell phone from a government agency. <laughs> uh, do you mean she's at LA? It appears that Ika's reasoning was right. Ika, don't don't listen to her. She's trying to get it into your head. Real killers always say things like that. Bitch! Let me see those skills. Quit fooling around. You'll regret this. You're all you're all going to be killed by the real killer. Nanako, keep your eye on a Rafael for me. <laughs> Maybe. I think that's the others. <laughs> Everyone else, please come here. I have an idea. I want to discuss the three of you. This is a confusing thing. I thought it was. I thought you're. I think you're messing with me here. Like I, I chose someone that's not her head. Ah. An idea. Okay, wrong voice. An idea. What are you going to do? What are we gonna do? Torture her until she talks? No. You will just say what the whatever you want them to say when you torture them. Prove me wrong. Close, but no cigar. We're going to reveal the killer's identity. What? You're making zero sense right now, Ika. Yes! Her psychology. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well. Well, right, I got her. Haha! <laughs> Because I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> Hi, you. Hi, you. Calm down, Akari. Rahil isn't the killer. Perfect. What? <laughs> what? What do you mean? Um, um, I, I'm still not following what's What's going on? Judging from the murders, it was obvious that the killer is a well-trained professional. It would have been difficult to neutralize them if they had been on their guard. That's why I had to play the trick on them. I was confused. I was confused when Ikata started to find me, but then he whispered a, his little plan in my ear. Ooh. Clever motherfucker! The rope was loose three times, so I could easily escape and sneak up to Angeso. Looks like your plan worked, Ikuda. In a sense, I was stunned when Rahel suddenly stood up. Perfect! Now we know that Rahel thought it was a pet. It worked! But Ikuda, you didn't need to tell everyone that I'm an undercover agent. Well, we had to fool them somehow. <laughs> so, from here, it does time to kind of end the episode. So, I hope all you guys are safe, well fed, and a great day to you. Now, see you guys next time while I question what the fuck I'm doing.